and from other parts of Africa. Top UN officials have warned the Security Council that more than 400,000 people in Ethiopia's Tigray were not in famine. And they also said on Friday that there was a risk of more clashes in the region, despite a unilateral ceasefire by the federal government after six private discussions. The Security Council held its first public meeting since fighting broke out in November between government forces and TPLF fighters. Acting UN aid chief Ramesh Rajeshingam told the council that the humanitarian situation in Tigray had worsened dramatically in recent weeks with an increase of some 50,000 in the number of people now suffering famine. And U.S. Ambassador to the United Nations, Linda Thomas Greenfield, has urged all parties to negotiate and honor a true ceasefire. One of the most distressing trends is an alarming rise in food insecurity and hunger due to conflict. More than 400,000 people are estimated to have crossed the threshold into famine, and another 1.8 million people are on the brink of famine. Some are suggesting that the numbers are even higher. 33,000 children are severely malnourished, and moreover, the food insecurity crisis will continue to worsen during the impending rainy season. This week, the government unilaterally announced a ceasefire, stating it was doing so for humanitarian purposes. The government must now demonstrate that it truly intends to use the ceasefire to address the humanitarian catastrophe in Tigray. In short, there is potential for more confrontations and a swift deterioration in the security situation, which is extremely concerning. The ceasefire announcement provides an opportunity that all parties to the conflict, including the TPLF, must seize and build upon. In this regard, we urge the TDF to endorse the ceasefire immediately and completely. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.